Now, Judiciary Uganda has announced the death of a retired judge, Lady Justice Elizabeth Nahamia, who has passed on in Netherlands. Uh, she passed on earlier on today, but uh, the cause of death has not been communicated. The Judiciary added that the burial arrangements will be communicated later. She becomes the very first government official to die this year. May her soul rest in peace. <music> Brother Roni Makabai, the senior pastor best in Entebbe, has prophesied that this year is going to be full of blood and death right here in Uganda, claiming that God has told him that in 2023, the crime rate is going to rise, some of the security officers will join the criminals, and that a number of people are going to be killed. Brother Roni has pleaded with President Museveni to put more money in security, insisting that the current problem the country faces is insecurity and that if not taken seriously, Uganda will turn ungovernable. Well, he added that Museveni should use the tactics used by security bosses when women were being killed in areas of Entebbe, Wakiso and Nasana by reshuffling them. Well, in other news, Police in northern Uganda has arrested three people who have been swindling money from the NRM party members promising to take them to President Museveni, the First Lady Janet Kataha Museveni, the Prime Minister Rubina Nabanja, and even Honorable Nobat Mao, the Minister for Justice and Constitutional Affairs. These people have been collecting a lot of money, so far from over 200 people who have brought in their complaints, but we are suspecting that there are many more outside there who, who lost their money in, 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 in such a manner. Collected this money in the name of taking us to Kampala, like uh, they are going to take us to President Yuweri Kakuta Museveni. Well, they said, when you are going to the state house, you have to be in uniform. That was 50,000 shillings. Then, for registration. Then 50 for the uniform. Making up 60. After the 60,000, it came like a month of August. Now they were asking us, because if they are asking for that money, they want you to pay there and then, because they can tell you that on Monday, when it's a Saturday, on Monday we are leaving to Kampala to set house. So from there we were convinced that we have to pay a transport fee of 165000 On top of the 65000 for the uniform, we had to pay. Most of the people, and they were talking of taking 200 people. I, for one, am a peasant farmer. I had some sheep. I had to sell off my three great sheep. Well, there you go. That is Uganda for you, my friend. <laughs> that is Uganda for you. But uh, don't forget to subscribe in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. This is The Buzz UG. And uh, my name is Melads Milo, a.k.a. Fula. It's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio Jungle.